what is going on YouTube it's a boy Billy Kibaki and in today's video I'm gonna show you how to make a debug eboot for your HFW 4.82 and PS3 using hen okay I'm not gonna show anything else I'm just gonna show how to make it how to convert any original eboot into a debug eboot for your games for instance you will need a debug eboot when you're using the RTM tools so for instance Call of Duty or GTA 5 if you guys want to see me use this debug eboot for mod loaders on GTA 5 let me know in the comments and I will make another video about that but in this video I'll be only showing you how to make your eboot into a debug eboot alright so let's go ahead and get started so right here I have the hen eboot slash SFO and SPRX resigner this was sent to me by OFW mods so shout out to OFW mods you guys can check out his channel or his link will be in the description as well you will need your original eboot so whatever game you're gonna use if you're gonna use GTA 5 if you're gonna use um, Call of Duty or any other game you will need the original eboot from that game alright so right here I have the original eboot from my GTA game all you have to do is just go ahead and cut it go to the resigner folder and you just want to paste it right there so here it is here is the eboot next all you have to do is just go ahead and run the bat file right here the n eboot resigner you want to choose option 1 resign eboot then press enter press enter again you're gonna get this message right there just go ahead and press enter one more time that's it you can resign it to um, to NPDRM 3.55 or NPDRM 4.21 or resign it to disk type app um, I'm just gonna use 3.55 that works for me just the same so I'm gonna select number one press enter and just give it time and there you go auto resign finish uh, press any key we can close this down down here now we have one eboot that says eboot.bin.orig this means original and this one right here is now the debug eboot so that's how easy it is so from this point on you can use the corresponding debug eboot with the corresponding game to load up your mod loader or you can also go ahead and start using it with your RTM tools okay so very simple very easy guys if the video was helpful please give it a like share the video around and also you guys can subscribe for more video to come thank you all for watching i will see you guys in my next video